Today, I'm going to be giving you a closer look at these Easter photo booth props. So it comes wrapped up in this nice little box. And inside you have your pages of props that need to be punched out. And it also comes with the sticks and 3M adhesive strips that you can attach the prop to the stick with. So there they are, just the thin individual little strips. Now I'll go through, through each of these pages so you can see exactly what kind of props you have with this. There are religious pieces like crosses, there are carrots and bunnies, there are props that you can wear. As you can see from some of these, they punch out pretty easily and are practically falling out of the pages, which is great because you will need to punch each of these out individually and assemble. Because these props are for Easter, you see a lot of bright colors and pastels and bunnies and little chicks. So these would be fun to use with your kids to take little Easter pictures or if you're having a little party or family get togethers to set up a little photo booth area. So a lot of them you'll need to punch out of the cardboard and some have smaller pieces that need to punch out as well. I'll just show you how simple it is to assemble. It does take a bit of time because there are many props that come with this. So you'll just punch out all of your pieces and these are kind of like a heavy laminated cardstock kind of thing. Pull out one of your sticks. And then these 3M adhesive strips, they're just tiny thin little strips. So you'll peel off of the backing and stick that adhesive side onto your stick. Now you do wanna hold it on there for a couple of seconds to make sure that it sticks very well. And then you'll just peel off that backing side there and stick it onto your prop and apply a little bit of pressure there as well to make sure that it sticks well. Now I have done a similar, I have bought a similar um, photo booth props for Christmas props before and these adhesive strips really work a lot better than I thought. Um, after some use and being handled and played with by kids and things, they do start to peel off a little bit with those adhesive strips. There's your finished product there. So I would consider maybe hot gluing these as well. So here's a look at all of those props punched out. As far as assembly goes, there are enough sticks that you have one for every prop, but there are several extra of these adhesive strips. So should they get loose and fall off, you can definitely replace because you've got tons of extra. It does take a little bit of time for assembly to punch all of those out and stick all the sticks on, but it's easy to do and if you've got some friends that can come over and help you, it makes the job go faster. So here's a look at all of those assembled pieces that you have to work with. The majority of your photo booth props are going to be those that you can wear. With this set, you've got hats, you've got little things that go above your hair, you have ties, neckties and bow ties, you have different lips, and glasses and rabbit ears. Even some mustaches. And then you've got your prop pieces. These are just various pieces that you can use for taking fun pictures, different props, like chicks and carrots and candy pieces. So that's been your closer look at these Easter photo booth props. So anytime that you've got family members together or friends and you're having a little party at Easter time, you've got these great pastel photo booth props that you can use for fun poses and pictures with your friends.